Guys, I'm going to show you how to build a TNT cannon. So you will need stone, water buckets, redstone, redstone repeaters, um, stone slabs, any kind of slabs. Uh, let me show you. Any kind of slabs here. Yeah. TNT and a spruce button or a lever. So you will build a nine block stone. So you'll need one, wait. Okay, yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Then I'm just seeing how. Yeah, then you build one, two. Then you go one, two, three, four. Then it looks like that, basically. Like that. Then you must do that. Look like that. Break the bottom piece. Place water. Then it should look like this if you did it right. Place a slab. Looks like that. Then place a button here. Let me see if it just works. Yeah, it works. Then you go like around like that. Two blocks empty. Because that's where I want to put my stone. If you did it correctly, that's how it must look like. Then you put one like that. Place two TNT like that, because that's how it makes it work. Work properly. And then you place like that. So it should look like that if you did it correctly. Then you break four. One, two, three, four. You place them like that. One, two, no. One, two. So you should have four in total. Like that. Then you can put them all the way to the end. Then it should look like that. Place a TNT there. And put as many as you want. Press that. Then it should go like that. Trigger that and then it should blow. So that's the TNT cannon. You can place a lot if you want. Place a lot. Put that there. And then it triggers that and then look. So that's the TNT cannon. If you did it right, if I break the slab, the water shouldn't go out. But that's the TNT cannon. I hope you guys enjoyed it and um, try and bolt it and see you next time. Bye.